Uh, huge. Um, we're down 3-0, three, three I think. Mm -hmm. So to get that win is huge here at home. Uh, so to have that start for me, like I didn't feel great. So to turn it around was uh, felt great. And then after trailing 4-3 to three into the third period, what was your mindset coming into it? Just keep us keep us in the game because we were only down 4-3. So uh, just play my game and hopefully we turn it around. It's exciting. Uh, you know, that was pretty exciting for us uh, from the second period on. And, um, you know, when you get a power play like that that late in the game, in a tie game, you want to obviously be the, be the guy or, or be out there. And I thought, uh, you know, we had a couple chances and, uh, you know, I was lucky enough to, to get one by them. And then what was the mindset going into the third period when you were trailing? Uh, we had belief in here. We, we, we weren't happy with our first period. Uh, we got better in the second and then uh, that carried over to the third. So uh, we believed we were coming back. Uh, uh, I thought we'd generate a lot of offense in the third. Oh, it was good. It felt good to uh, to get a win, especially in a game like that. So, um, you know, I felt good. I've been here a while, so it took me a while to get it. But, um, yeah, it was definitely exciting. And then, uh, so you guys were trailing for the thing. What changed, what, what changed the momentum going into the third period? Um, I mean, we had a sloppy first. And I think we acknowledged that in the room after the first period. I mean, Benny, you know, put a challenge to us to, to compete harder and stuff and I thought we did that for the rest of the game after the first period for the most part and um, you know our, our product they got a big goal at the end and um, so it was a, it was an overall it was a sloppy start but we managed to get uh, two points out of it which is uh, what I can ask for. Okay. And then you, the team has won the last three games now what is the momentum into Wednesday's game? Oh, well, it's huge. I mean, you win some games that, you know, maybe you don't have your best and uh, but being able to win those games is huge. Uh, just getting points early in the season. So um, with different guys playing different roles right now and some guys called up and hurt, it, uh, it says a lot about our depth right now. So um, we hopefully we can use that momentum going into next week and build off it. Well, I just think we got a lucky break. We actually started to play hockey. I thought we were on our heels to start the game and uh, you know, the game is a funny way of working out the ups and flows of the game. So. Uh, I think our players did a great job of fighting back and being resilient and it's not too often you win a game where you give up two power play goals against and you don't score in a five on three and mm -hmm. you're, you're down three nothing. So you know, credit to them for digging in. Obviously don't want, don't, we don't want to start like that, but uh, you know, at the end of the day, the guys fought back hard to get two points. And then the team has won the last three home games here. What are they performing well at and how will that go into Wednesday's game? Well, I think when you're playing at home, you have a little bit better control of some variables and you're sleeping in your own bed, you're eating your own meals, you're not eating out, and you're controlling more or less the structure of your routine. So uh, whether that's a direct correlation to our record at home, you know, maybe not, but you know, it definitely helps in a positive way.